Hey everyone, this is Jen Sheffer, Mobile Learning Coach for Burlington Public Schools, and today I want to show you how to take advantage of a relatively new Google Chrome extension that I think you will love, uh, especially if you're using Google Classroom, which many of you are. It is called the Share to Classroom extension, so I'm going to show you how to first get it. It's important to note that you must be in the Chrome browser in order to use this extension. So once you're in Chrome, you're going to go to the web store, and you can go ahead and launch the Google Chrome Web Store. And in your search box, you can type in Share to Classroom. And you want to add that extension to Chrome. You can do that by just simply clicking on this plus blue sign. And then from here, you're going to click Add Extension. And once the extension is added, you'll see it's over here to the right of my uh, Omnibox. So I can go ahead and close that. Now I'm going to show you how to actually use this extension. I can close this tab. And here I am in a Google Doc that I just created. And I want to share this with my students. I actually want this to be an assignment. Now with the Classroom extension, what I can do is I can just click on this. And now the extension will load my classes. I can select my help desk class and the default is going to be push to students but what I want to do is select this drop down menu and I'm going to click create an assignment you'll notice I can also make an announcement but I'm going to hit create assignment and I'm going to call this guide to weekly reflections and I can also determine whether students can view edit or make a copy for each student and I want to make a copy for each student and then I want to assign it and I can also change the due date and that's it I have now posted that assignment to my classroom and if I want to view that that went successfully into my stream I can click on view I'm taken right there and there it is if I needed to make any edits for example I can go ahead and do that if I need to, I want to change the due date, and I want to make this due on Friday, the 18th. And then I can click Save. So I just showed this to my colleague, Jen Brumby. She was able to test it out with me. She shared a article from the web with her students uh, using that extension, and she did it in minutes. And she really liked it and said, you know what, I think I'll definitely be using this extension. So I would add it to your um, Chrome extensions. And if you have any questions, please let me know. But this is one more way to save time, increase your productivity and your efficiency with Google Classroom. Thanks so much for watching.